when should you use with? So with with we're we're able to without putting in the object the object reference we can just put in the the um uh, the method name. With that it makes it a little confusing where it comes from. That way there are certain um uh, ways you should be using with and certain ways that you shouldn't be using. I I found that the way I'm going to show you is my favorite way of using it and which reduces the amount of confusion on myself and other developers. So first of all, I'm going to show you what it looks like to have something that looks um that looks good in my eyes and I think that is a very good way. You can show me a different way in the comments, but me I think this is a good way for me there may be a better way but first of all I have person and I have um you may have person dot see what we have here I think we have um height so we're gonna change height we're gonna change weight 40 and we're gonna change um money in pockets Tools 40 and then we're going to print line the weight Right simple stuff We're going to change this to var to That was a valid I believe um, now you can see this and see that it's Relatively easy to read it's person and you know it's person because These are these all come from Person except the print line, that's a method that we all know that we should know. The very generic method that we know. We see here that every single method call, every single variable call is coming from person, and that's good. We have no confusion. But what if we have other things in here? So for example, um we have animal, a creature, bird, color, blue, and can true. And say we have animal dot color equals black. And we have um, foul plus something like uh, equals. Right, F there, and then we have right, and now we have it here, and we this looks a little more confusing. We have this with a person, and we have this height, and then we have this animal color, and then we have this weight, and then um, uh, where does this color come from? I um, I understand that that's purple for the one that comes from person, but this color is coming from somewhere. It, 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 it doesn't belong there. Um, when you, when you scan this very quickly, you, um, see with person and you just expect everything in here belongs to person, but you see these two ones and you skip over it and you may not see them. You make it confused. You may have to look at this. For a slightly longer time to figure out what's really going on. My rule is is if I have a width of person, I allow only width to be in there. The width of that person. So if I have person in there, I only have person and I may have very generic um methods that anyone knows, or I have a method within this instance within this 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 class i mean that i know um i don't call things from other objects such as a model object i will call things such as inserting to a database like sql lights i will you know doing things like db dot insert height weights that is okay um, what's not okay is doing, you know, animal.color because you're doing it from another object. Um, and what I mean by another object, I mean another model, another Pojo 
um with with you only want one one model in there it's okay to call other other methods within your class um as long as you don't have too many you, you only have one model in there you only have one of, of that you should make it you know within this width you know 80 percent of it should be from methods and and um variables from this object that's why i think is clean there may be a, a um another way maybe you can show me in the comments if there is a better way